Messages of Tuesday 12th of October 2021 Prayer Meeting, Live Facebook Italy Holy Virgin Mary My children, I'm the Immaculate Conception, I'm the woman who gave birth to the Word, I'm Jesus's mother and your mother. I've descended with very great power, together with my Son Jesus and God the Omnipotent Father. The Most Holy Trinity is among you. Together with me, there are the little shepherds of Fatima, as I promised you. We're going to reveal to you the great secret of Fatima, day by day more and more. October 12th was the eve of the great miracle of the Son that God the Omnipotent Father bestowed on Fatima. On this day, I spoke to my daughter Lucia. I told her that, after the miracle, many things would change. I told her that she'd never see her cousins Jacinta and Francisco anymore. The persecutions were many. The greatest pain for them was being persecuted by the church. Many times they were brought before different priests, but their truth was always one. They always said, there's nothing more beautiful than to love Our Lady. Nothing and no one ever corrupted them. My children, I revealed to them that the absolute power, that the church had taken, would become stronger and stronger and in one of my apparitions I showed them hell. Lucia, Jacinta and Francisco covered their faces, because they saw burning in those flames even the souls that they knew and that tempted them to deny everything. I told them that, soon, they would help heaven to cry out the truth. These are the times that I had announced to them. In each of my apparitions, I made them kiss the crucifix. They were always to keep it in their pockets, a sign of faith against the church which in these times has trampled on the divine sacrifice. Don't let yourselves be confused, because, soon, the church will exalt the cross, but it won't be that of my son Jesus. On that day, the intervention of the little shepherds of Fatima has been established. You'll recognize the lie, because on the cross you'll see skulls drawn, they'll be the same skulls that Lucia, Jacinta and Francisco saw in hell. My children, let yourselves be filled with my son Jesus's love in order to understand what I'm telling you. Those, who already know Satan's plans, will try to hinder you. The plot within the Vatican walls is great. The third secret of Fatima, which we're explaining to you, will make many souls repent. My daughter Lucia had the task of revealing it to some prelates. Those, who tried to tell the truth, were silenced even with their lives. Fatima was to shine by proclaiming my daughter Lucia, saint on earth, even in this my son John Paul II was hindered, but what was revealed will be shouted to the whole world. My daughter Lucia, my daughter Jacinta and my son Francisco wish to speak to you. Lucia of Fatima Brothers, sisters, it's Lucia of Fatima, the little shepherdess who meant nothing. Today, I'm the messenger of Our Lady, the world will have to accept it. Lucia, Our Lady told me, you've been chosen, I'll reveal to you the secrets of heaven together with Jacinta and Francisco, three important secrets. The first one concerns you, it concerns your future. Jacinta and Francisco will soon leave this world. You'll have to stay here for a long time by my will. I'll make known to you the evil that is in the church, it isn't all good. When you're older, you'll understand what I mean. Lucia, she said to me, Francisco will hear my voice. He desires it and I'll give him this joy, because I, Lucia, was suffering so much. I tried to explain everything to Francisco, but I couldn't. He was very good, very humble. For me, it was right that he'd hear Our Lady's voice, which was wonderful, even though some things made us suffer. Madam, don't leave me alone. Don't be afraid, Lucia you won't be alone. I'm with you and Jacinta and Francisco, from above, will watch over you. This was the first secret, I'd have to face the world. Soon, Francisco will tell you about this, the first secret, Jacinta, on the other hand, will tell you about the second secret. That day was different, it wasn't like the others. We were upset, Our Lady showed us hell. We screamed, we cried. That apparition lasted a long time. That meadow, covered with fire. Many souls on the cross, upside down, came out and in through the flames. A lot of laughing and crying at the same time. 
The smell was unpleasant, like setting fire to animals, it was horrible. The earth opened up and many people sank into it like a waterfall. It felt like falling, the emptiness was in our stomachs. We hugged each other and then it was all over. Lucia, Our Lady told me, here go the souls who deny our Lord, especially those who love lies. Very soon, Jacinta will speak to you about the second secret that concerns this matter. To me, the third secret has been entrusted, the one that speaks of the future of humanity. You must know, Lucia, that the world is in danger, the church is responsible. Many innocent people will be martyrs in the church, but as soon as these end, everything will be in Satan's hands, confusing the world. It will be very difficult for them to believe what I revealed to you, but our Lord will give the confirmations. The outrages, the sacrileges are many, all hidden, but all will come out. You must know, Lucia, the good and the bad to be able to help me. Many powerful people will work against God. In the not too distant future, many will die of serious diseases. The cures will be discovered, but they won't be told. Many epidemics will break out in the world by human hands, it will be the powerful of the world that will do all this. Even in the church the powerful, that will be at the head of it, will spread lies. The people will no longer follow them. Madam, I don't understand all this. I know it, Lucia, as the years go by, you'll understand and you'll carry my word, my messages. I'm with you. In the last apparition, that Jacinta and Francisco and I had together, Our Lady asked us to embrace each other. We understood that this was the last time we'd see Our Lady together. We sang, and we want to sing again today, Hail, Hail, Hail Mary. Francisco of Fatima Little brothers and little sisters, what we experienced that day gave us such strength. We wanted to fulfill Our Lady's will, even though we didn't want to detach ourselves. Our Lady's love helped us to overcome even this moment. The sufferings, which humanity will undergo, will be great and we wanted to do everything to avoid them, but the world wouldn't understand that without our Lord there's no salvation. We'll speak to you in detail, that you may understand what will come to pass very soon. Dot. Jacinta of Fatima Little brothers and sisters, it's I, your little sister Jacinta. I prayed so much to be able to speak to you, because we, even though we were very small, know so much. Our Lady revealed to us things that are very important for the world. In one of the apparitions, Lucia asked her, Madam, what do you desire of us? She replied, I wish to carry my voice through you to the world, so that all may know the truth. I desire to reveal to you the future, now, you don't understand, but later you'll understand. I was very small, I didn't understand much, but Our Lady said to me, Jacinta, I desire that you pray much more. And I began, from that day, to understand more and more the importance of the things that Our Lady was revealing to us. Our Lady told us much, I desire that you always carry the crucifix with you. I want you to kiss it every day, day and night. Lucia, Francisco and I always had it with us. We taught it to do so, so that our Lord could feel loved. Every day, he's despised in the world. The sacrifice, that he made for the salvation of our souls, is no longer understood. Our Lady revealed the secrets to us and she said, that which I revealed to you isn't to be revealed yet. I'll tell Lucia, when she'll able to reveal it. Lucia of Fatima Brothers, sisters, we want to greet Our Lady together. Let's all embrace. Let's all sing together, Hail, Hail Mary. Holy Virgin Mary. Thank you, my children. I'm weeping tears of joy for you. Never fear, because the truth is about to triumph. There will be no more deception and, in the moment of temptation, hold fast to me. I'll make you feel my love. I love you. Our mission is over. I together with the three shepherd children of Fatima, have to go. I'm giving you a kiss, my children. I'm blessing you all, in the name of the Father, the Son and the Holy Spirit. Shalom. Peace, my children.